I think um, we've been fortunate in the last month to probably have seen three of the best goals in world world soccer. Um, Hasley's up at Seattle. Susie's against um, Dallas. Um, that one tonight. Uh, I mean, if Cristiano Ronaldo scores that goal, or, or the goals I've just mentioned, or Messi, is splattered all over the globe. You know, in world soccer, everywhere. Um, so we've been fortunate enough that you know three MLS players have scored three world-class goals. Guys are on the ropes, and they've got to get ourselves back on track. You know, I'm not slotting anybody. Um, try, you know, good young players, good young men. The quicker we get back to getting the first goal and getting a little bit of confidence through ourselves again, that's what we need. We need to score the first goal. And then we've got another big game coming up next. Um, you know, one on Thursday and then and one on Sunday against our, our dearest rivals. It's confidence. You know, we sometimes confidence, lack of confidence looks like a lack of effort. See, when things are going well, you're full of energy. You can run for fun. You know, you, you just, you, you're just feeling so good about yourself. When things go against you and you go a goal down, that's when the legs start to feel heavy and you start to you know, hear your breathing, your lung, and you're saying to yourself, geez, I'm tired tonight, I'm tired. And that's when all the negatives start to sit in. We need to score a first goal and get ourselves going again. Um, the, 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 the great thing about playing here is our fans never have an off night. You know, their fans are well experienced. Their Timbers Army are well experienced. They've played and they've, you know, cheered a lot of games. We've got a, a lot of young players right now that are just learning the game, and they're thrown into the Lions. This is the Lions Den. This is a, this is a cauldron. This is a fantastic place to play, but it, it you know makes you grow up very quick, or it makes you hide. Um, and you when know, we've got a few inexperienced young men, but they're going to they're going to become better individuals and better players when they come out the other side. Uh, I think it was a corner, I'm not sure, but the ball went in and popped back out and I was going to hit it first time, but it didn't fall right and just controlled it and then uh, just hit it and well, thankfully it went in. Just talk a little bit, you ran over to see Coach Spencer right away. What was, what's that relationship like? What was that hug about, you know, a little uh, bit about that experience? He told me I was going to score yesterday, so that's what it was about. He told you he was going to score today? Yeah, yesterday he was like, you're going to score tomorrow, and I was like, I hope, and I did. It's quite a hole that, you know, we've put ourselves in. Um, you know, I haven't helped us out tonight. And I think the first one was my fault. And I got to do better. And you know, we, we just have to find ourselves again. You know, find what what made us uh, a winning team and, and get back to winning ways. And uh, I think we'll be okay. You know, we're not sitting here. We're not going to feel sorry for ourselves. We're going to get back to work and you know, sort all this out. I don't think organization or tactics is is the thing that's killing us right now. It's just uh, little mistakes. You know, from me all the way up and. You know, it, it, we got to put a stop to it.